parents, it's Mr. Ingram, principal of ECA. Thank you for joining me. We have been busy working on how to reopen our school with a high priority on student and staff safety. Our ECA staff has already met several times and we continue to meet on a weekly basis. You should have received an email with Q&As about our plans to reopen school. Uh, that email includes an exhaustive list of the kinds of questions that you would ask as a parent of a child who may be returning to our school. Uh, we plan to continue to send you more updates on reopening details in the next few weeks. Please know that we are required by law to follow the rules that have been set by the DC Department of Health, uh, the Office of the State Superintendent of Education, and the DC Public Charter School Board. It is important that we follow these rules and regulations strictly in order to protect our students and staff. Uh, parents, please know that first, second, and third grade and all students with IEPs will be returning for in-person learning. Pre-kindergarten and kindergarten will continue in the virtual learning mode. A parent link to apply for your child's in-person learning was sent today by text and by email. So check your text messages and your emails for that information. The deadline for completion is Friday, March 26th. In-person slots are limited. Children will be registered in order of our receipt of your completed application. Finally, um, one other feature of our in-person programming is we are hiring uh, ECA partners to provide support during in-person learning and assist us with the health and safety of the school. This is a temporary part-time position that might be of interest to you as a parent or grandparent of a student here at ECA. You can access the application on our website at www.ecapcs.org. Thanks again for joining me this week and we'll talk again soon.